Since the start of the pandemic, grocery stores in Montana have faced challenges in keeping items on their shelves. That includes small town grocery stores, too. MTN's Jonathan Imbarian spoke to one owner about what it's taking to keep his business stocked. At the D&D food town in Lincoln, some of the aisles still look fairly full, but there are some obvious gaps. I actually got some toilet paper in Lincoln yesterday. There's still some on the shelf today. Soups are a tough deal. Flour, bread, anything cheap, Marishaw noodles, things that people just need to get by for a quick dinner, they're gone. People are coming in by them. As soon as they come out the truck, people are buying them. Owner Ron Arambari says it's been hard for the last three weeks to keep the most sought after items in stock. Put it this way, as soon as the word pandemic was put out by the government, that's when all stores went crazy. Arambari also owns stores in Shoto, Fairfield, and Stanford. They all get the vast majority of their groceries delivered through a cooperative in Utah. He said it's easier than it was to get what he needs, but still far from normal. Our first couple grocery loads were days, days, and days late. We'd get maybe 30% of the product that we ordered. So far this week, I got 43% of the groceries that I ordered, and trucks are running on time. The stores also saw people coming in from out of town looking for the same items. Arambari says some of his local customers are concerned about the outside traffic, but he understands why it's happening. If it was up to me and I went to a big store in a big town and they were out of something and I went to a smaller town and they had the product, I would buy it for my family. I don't turn anybody away for anything. We're here to help no matter what we can do. Arambari says he wants to recognize his staff for the work they've done during this time. I've got 80 plus employees. They're on the front line. They're working face to face with these people every day to accommodate to keep society going right now. And it's really tough. It really is. In Lincoln, Jonathan Amberian, MTN News. Stores like D&D are taking many of the same precautions as larger stores, such as putting tape on the floor to encourage customers to social distance and offering masks and gloves for employees.